Hello everybody, and welcome back to WWE 2K18, 2K19, I am the guy known as Kasai, and we are on for chapter 2, where we are scheduled, Victor Black versus the monster among men, Braun Strowman. Oh, we gonna get these hands! First of all, I'm gonna put on my player tree. So I can show you what about, show you, show you my character build so far. So, that's that's how far I've gotten with one side. Working on the sub tree, I've decided to go brawl. So, uh, it's it's more to do with turnbuckle. That sounds very heelish. You know, we can get that quickly. Let me just put that on. Where is it? 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 I don't know. There it is. Bam. Chair for a spinning crack. Ooh. Sounds very much like a Van Damonate. No, probably because it actually is a Van Damonate. Um, just gonna boost some bits up. We've got some two overcharge points I've been working on. Beast mode. As that sounds pretty, pretty strong. I think it was more of an increase in strength anyway for a limited amount of time. I'm just gonna work our way up the tree here. Just quickly get some out of the way. 53 overall so far. Let's we'll see how far we get with the story bit here. Just get some springboard offense. I don't think I'll ever be using a springboard move. I'll probably we'll see. Let's see how, how crazy Victor Black wants to go. There we go. What's this? For a table? He's nice, nice. Get a table power bomb or something. I don't know. Um, work on that aerial offense. Just gonna keep everything balanced between each point. So, you know, we're kind of mixed here. There we go. We've got Technician now. That'd be hella good. Lower stamina for reversals. That's always brilliant. Way up, got two more points. Can escape would be useful, so let's get some grapple reversal in there. And uh, oh, I think that's ladder jumper, right? Yeah, ladder jumper. We don't want that. We want, we want that pin escape. And we got oh, what's this? What this? So we've unlocked escape eyes, cell wall. Oh, let's hope we have a hell of a cell match at some point. There we are, 53 overall. Keeping things nice, keeping things uh, going. So we've got Little Miss Bliss and Baron Blade here. Let's talk to Alexa Bliss first. Hey, I've seen some of your indie stuff online. Not bad. Keep it. You have reached your first dialogue branch. There might be different conversations or outcomes on what you choose. Choose wisely. Okay. 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 Thanks, any advice on facing Braun? I've seen what he's capable of when he was my partner in the Mixed Match Challenge. Yeah, Based on that, I suggest you start running. Now. Alright. Okay. I ain't running. Hey. I can say a bit so weird. Well, I think what's on TV. Oh, what's on TV? Every I can't believe I <laughs> And I can't believe how stupid you are in person. I look forward to watching Braun destroy you tonight. Brilliant. So you've worked in the WWE in the past. Any last minute advice for me? Yeah, don't face the Crimson King. He's not gonna Just make the most of your opportunity, win or lose. Matt Bloom brought you in here because he saw something in yes. you. Just go out there and show him that again. Oh, and try to get some free swag. I'd like a Bootio's lunchbox if you're taking requests. I'm not taking requests. I have kind of bigger things on my mind than boot years, lunchbox. What, like a replica title belt? N no, Braun Strowman. Of course, just trying to keep the mood light. But if you do see a lunchbox lying around... No. We will focus on you later. Time to go to the track match. Here we go, Victor Black, Braun Strowman! Still cage match. Baron Plate is a retired WWE superstar. 
who left for unknown reasons to become a... Shit, I know the reasons. Uh, Rumours suggest WWE wouldn't execute his visions for a newer, never-before-seen type of match. Actually, the Crimson King retired. We already know that. Come on. Oh, yeah. Hit him in the head a couple of times. And from San Diego, California. Oh my god, they let me keep this music. 238 pounds. Victor Black. First time on roll. Let's go, baby. I am so so ready for this. Steel King match. Look at him, that swagger as he walks. Quick step up the steps. Quick step up the steps. Man. Show one. Boom! Troll Vipers from just that. We laugh at fireworks in there. But yes. Victor Black looking ready. And here comes the monster in the there. Whoa. <laughs> Former member of the White family. Former money in the bank holder. Not Universal Champion. Though. But uh, in the real world, we are waiting for him to take on Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar at Crown Jewel, Saudi Arabia. I think it was either uh, that or in India. I don't know. I'll check it out. Oh, here we go. BB. In a cage. Let's go, bam! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What the what? Is that how tiny Braun Strowman's thing is? Does he have no submission based offense whatsoever? Oh boy. Oh man. Go! I heard this is actually Go. this guy's trial no. match tonight. What's he trying out for? To be a crowd no. test dummy? Okay, 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 okay. Too fast. Yeah, no. No. Uh, uh, um, I tried. I tried. I swear. The boy Victor Black failed against the monster among men. Not surprised, honest. Not surprised, to be honest. Had them squash match debuffed, yo. the VB losing the Braun Strowman. It's all fine. It's okay. It's good. You did a good job out there. Really? Feels like I got run over by a big bearded tank. Think it was enough for him to sign me? I don't know. But no matter what, you always have a home in the BCW. Appreciate that with you. Thanks. Hey, I saw a lot of positive things from you tonight. Oh. Most importantly, you didn't seem intimidated by being on the bigger stage or by being locked in the cage with a monster. Yes. So with that being said, we'd like to offer you an NXT contract. Look that over and return it at tomorrow night's show. This is amazing. Thank you. I would shake your hand, but I think three of my fingers are dislocated. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Rest up and we'll finalize everything tomorrow night. Nice. You did it. I'm shocked. Me too. I just can't believe it. I mean, against all odds. I know. I'll definitely be sad to see you go. You've become one of my top guys. You'll be fine though, right? I mean, you got Cole and the rest of the crew, yeah? Sorry, what, what am I doing? This is 
your time to celebrate, not to worry about me and BCW. You enjoy the moment. I'm gonna go talk to Triple H about when you might start, so maybe I can get you on one more BCW show. Ooh. We'll do a big farewell match. It'll be great. Sounds good. Yeah, mister. I... I'll see you back at the hotel. Congrats. I'm... I'm proud of you. Thanks, Baron. The I could have done it without you. <laughs> a contract. For Victor Black to go to NXT. Don't forget to check your phone in the hub. You can also upgrade your player and listen to podcasts and voice messages you receive. Even though Brenda is been he's planning to work unless you feel late. He had a good reduction in October and bring up new time. That's a bit cultivating them into champions. Nice. Yeah, one particular guy. Was tonight just a one time thing? Or are you signing with WWE? Well, actually, I was literally just offered an NXT contract, and I can't wait to get started. You should just skip NXT and go straight to the main roster. Actually, you know what? Hey, Triple H, you say listen to your audience? Well, the audience is saying that I'm good enough to go straight to the main roster, which actually, I think I proved it tonight by going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down, oh. but... Oh. 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 Yeah, what was that all about? Guy in a mask. Come attack the, um, uh, the main event, Victor Black. What's going on? Woo! Me too. The next day. Oh. I proved Whoa. it tonight by going toe to toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down, but. Less than 24 hours after we offer you the opportunity of a lifetime, you get into a fight with a fan outside a WWE event, and there's video. I'd really love to hear this explanation. Um. Um, um, the fan attacked Look, me the first. Fan attacked me first. I was just defending myself. What am I supposed to do? Just stand there and get beat up? All we can see is you fighting with a member of the WWE universe, and that's not good. Well, that's how it happened. You need to understand, this isn't some rinky-dink independent promotion running shows at the Elks Lodge. This is a publicly traded, global company. We can't have our WWE superstars getting into fights with fans, and it will not be tolerated. On top of that, you were bashing NXT, saying you were going straight to the main roster. Who in the hell do you think you are? I was just having fun with the fans. I was just about to say that I would be happy to go to NXT, and the fan attacked me. Oh, I bet. This is what I get for trying to do business with one of your guys, Baron. Come on, Hunter. Can't you just find him or something? No, because I can't find him if he's not on the active roster. I'm rescinding the contract offer. Leave the building or I will have security escort you out. Don't ever bring me one of his guys again. This is on you too. Understood. Okay. Remember what I said about making me regret my decision? Congratulations. You did it in record time. Dan. That's not good. That is not good. No! Hey, this wasn't your fault. I'm sure we'll figure out something else. Now, come on. Grab your stuff. We gotta go. Oh, the saddened Victor Black, as he does not make his cuts in the WWE. Struck the system. A few days later. Just a minute. Wakey, wakey, Jake the Snakey. 
And that's not funny. Uh, it is too early for that to be funny. Sorry, yeah. I couldn't wait to tell you the good news. Triple H called and wants to offer me a contract again? No. Better. What could be better than that? Well, after news of your NXT contract being pulled hit the internet, your fan fight video went viral. It's over 2 million views now. Sorry, make that 2.2 million. So a whole lot of people have watched me throw my career away. Why is that a good thing? Because controversy creates cash. My phone's been blowing Ow. up. Everyone wants to book you now. You're the hottest thing on the indie scene. And based upon the principle of supply, there's only one of you. And demand, like I said, is high. Your rate is skyrocketing. Okay, okay, this could be good. It could be very good. We could turn chicken crap into chicken salad, if you know what I'm saying. No, not really. I don't think I get it. Neither You're going to stick it to Triple H and WWE by making your own success in the indies. You'll be way bigger than you ever would have been at NXT or WWE, and we'll do it together. So what do you say? Are you in? I mean, what other choice do I have? I'm in. I'm in. All right. All right. Now, go brush your teeth. Your breath is terrible. Oh, dear. It's too early for this. <laughs> it's too early for this. Nice chapter two complete. What that time though? What that time though? I say we keep going. I say we keep going. I say. Oh, Buzz has inherited his band after his dad passed away. Oh no. He supported that Buzz pursues his dreams from a wrestler, but Buzz keeps from the dead. Exterminate his band to remind himself where he came from. El Mago. El Mago. The next week. The next week. Okay. Ow, ow. Oh, yeah. Hold up. Get out of that van, yo! Uh, somebody want to explain to me what's going on here? Give me a minute. Welcome to the new reality of BCW. Oh. Because of all your online hype, we sold out our usual allotment of tickets a few days ago. But, since I'm an entrepreneurial genius, I pulled some strings with the school principal, allowing us to move the show outside therefore doubling our capacity <laughs> all right all right good work but that's not all see those fancy video cameras and that nice gentleman i was just speaking with uh yeah for the first time ever BCW will be live streaming our event around the world on pay-per-view. So anyone who's not lucky enough to see Buzz in Buzz. person can still watch him do his thing from the comfort of their homes for a small but fair fee. Isn't it great? Uh, yeah, it's great. Question, who is Buzz? Oh, <laughs> that's your new nickname. You know, because of all the social media buzz you're generating. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. Buzz. <laughs> it's all turning into chicken salad, chicken my friend. Salad, okay. Uh, yeah. Speaking of making things not crappy, have you seen Cole? I feel like I should talk to him before our match tonight. Eh, he's around here somewhere. And oh, by the way, your match with him tonight is now falls count anywhere. Thought you two could have some fun with all the extra space out here. Fun, yeah. You really have an odd definition of the word fun. <laughs> All right. Uh, I call it Um, indicates you have a new podcast available. Listen to the latest podcast. Okay. His voice was the soundtrack for the biggest matches in squared circle history. And now he breaks down the latest happenings in the world of pro wrestling. 
Get ready for enticing conversations with legendary wrestling commentator Jack Tice. Yeah. From inside the ring to behind the scenes, you're about to be up to no good with former WWE superstar Hood Benson and his co-host Pete Clark. Uh, all right, yeah, Pete. I, I'm, I'm just saying, Pete. You can't get into a fight with a fan. Okay, let's just look at that other thingy. Um, well, we got some upgrading to do. Let's do a little bit of that. Gonna up that run defense offense. Just get moving. We got ladder jumping now. Let's just ban that. Here we are. Arm durability. Wow, is it it's slightly slower? Like I would prefer the um the dot to move just a touch faster. Load out. Oh, I need to buy that. Much. I forgot to buy the thing. Mm. Movement speed. Like this. Oh, we got catching finisher. Let's go. That'd be good. Get a couple of those. Do 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 Okay. Well, let's definitely get fired up. We want every submission we can get. There we are. Wonderful. Focus on this middle one first, I'd say. This is because I want beast mode to be as beast mode as possible. All right, all right, all right, all right. Messages. No, just dead. All right. Baron Blade first. Are you sure Cole and I should wrestle tonight? Kind of have a lot of bag baggage with everything after uh, after enough for our last match. That's exactly why you two should face each other. The fans are dying to see what happens next. In fact, I just heard so many people were trying to buy the pay-per-view that the website crashed. Guess I really want to, do want to see his face off. Is, is the site back online? Yeah, it was only temporary. And remember, it's Falls Count Anywhere tonight. So feel free to take the fight wherever you need to. Just as long as you don't damage the principal's car. She'll never let me do this out here again. Deal? All right. Oh, win. There he is. The man who drowned in his own rising tide. Come back to apologize to me for stealing my shot at WWE and immediately throwing it away? <laughs> Look, I am not apologizing for anything, okay? All I want to say is that we don't need to have each other's backs, but with what Baron is planning to do, the least we could do is have each other's respect. All right? So, are we good? <laughs> oh, yeah. We're so good. I thought I'd introduce you to my new character I'm trying out tonight. You remember how Matt Bloom didn't like Mr. CQ and decided to give you a tryout instead of me? Sure. Smart decision. I'm calling myself Black Hole Cole no. because I have an energy so intense, nothing can escape it. It's terrible. What? Oh, you don't like it? Why? Not a fan of masks these days. <laughs> you know, I find it really interesting that I was attacked by somebody wearing a mask, and next time I see you, you have a mask. Oh. Not to mention, you also had all the motivation in the world to do it. Mm. You're right. It was me. Was it you? So what are you gonna do about I'm it? Punch your face you so bad. Right now. It wasn't me. I, uh, I had a match that night, 300 miles away. I got the gas receipts to prove it. But I could have hired somebody to do it. What? It was a joke. 
Man, relax. You're real funny. Real funny. We'll see who's laughing after our match tonight. Huh. Also, that Cole Quinn guy definitely looks a lot like um, Bert from Bert and Ernie, Sesame Street. Oh my god, there's a top raise, rising star in Mexico. He's an unbelievable wrestler with immense talent and would like to compete in the WWE sometime, but he feels like he's sank to more to accomplish in his home country first. The Metropolitan Center is rarely used these days, but in the 90s it was one of the top bet venues for wrestling promotions, including WWE. Oh, a little bit higher than common ground. Just like sinking into the floor a little bit. Look at all them cars. And mine. Of black looking ready. Oh, dark and light. Mr. CQ wearing a mask today. looks terrible. Hmm. He does look absolutely terrible. I submit to Hot Superstar. I feel the power. Oh, oh chicken. He, he didn't go up the top rope. Oh, very, uh, very interesting. Why did he have one so do that? I wonder. We will find out soon, won't we? As Victor Black takes on Cole Quinn. Come here. Let me start with a lockup. Oh, that's not a lockup. Bam. Check him a couple times. Oi! Boom! DT. Funny that the ring. Oh! Then he. We have a sold-out, record-setting crowd here for BCW tonight. Oh. This is by far the hottest ticket in town. Take that! Bingo night at St. Mary's Church. Oh, oh. Yeah, push him off. That's it. Boom! Close line him. Get rid of all his on Get out of here. Get out of here. We're Buzz. That's his name now if you've been living under a rock. And Black Hole Hole. Yeah, okay. Are facing each other in a Falls Count Anywhere match. Oh, oh, you reversed my clothesline. This takes me back to the marathon me. Bang. down between Owen Schwartz and Mason Cunin for the title. Bang. For the title. Bam. Bam. Oh. Boom. Not the principal's car. And Buzz smashes into the window of his house. I mean, van. Buzz definitely doesn't live in his van. Bastard breaking my hand. So that's the principal's car? Huh, interesting. Get called to the South Barrier and then we'll Get over there. 
Black Hole Cole still feels like Buzz stole his WWE opportunity, and now he's out for revenge. He should also get revenge on whoever told him that new name was a good idea. Oh, what a... That clean tree getting a bit... Mm, boom. Boom. Hey, hey, hey. Here. Hey, hey. That's what BCW name. is all about. Fan interaction. <laughs> you don't just come and watch a BCW show. You're a part of it. You taking notes, Triple H? And they go. I'm going to use this chair. Doosh. Oh shit. Oh. oh. Oh no. Just a Psych. Reminder, this match to the is kick. Boom. Close line. In the general parking lot area, as we didn't pay to have the street closed. BCW is getting bigger, but we're not traffic control here. Okay? Boom. Hit him a couple of chaps, it's bad. Boom. We apologize if anyone's having difficulty with your pay-per-view stream. But to be honest, we underestimated the demand to see Buzz in action. We offer Boom. Boom. Here it right comes. Elbow drop back. How do we want to end this? How do we want to end this? Hey, Triple H, I know you're watching. Pick up. One, two, three, cut up. Bam! Cold wind is out cold. He is out cold, Quinn. Aha. See, I, I can make up gimmicks too, Paul. There we are. Victor Black. So close to Scoop slam him onto that chair. A boom! Oops, that's it. What are you gonna do, Cole Quinn? When Mr. VB, the main event VB, knows how he's doing. Tell him who's boss. Let's go. The man with purple and green hair. And black. Purple, green, and black. I don't know why, but you know. Purple, green, and black hair. You know. Just go on now. That was amazing. The live crowd loved it. You managed to avoid wrecking the principal's car. Nice. And the pay-per-view buys were off the charts. You two will be getting nice bonus checks in the mail for that. <laughs> oh, uh, I'll hand deliver yours since the last time I checked, you can't send mail to vans. <laughs> that was quite the battle. It was. Sorry about your windshield. It's okay. Baron said he'd pay for it. <laughs> hey, you're a lot tougher than I thought you were. You proved that tonight. And I didn't really get it before, but now I'm starting to understand why they're calling you Buzz. It's pretty much just Baron calling me that. It's gonna catch on. You'll see. Is it? Well, my bad for getting fired up about the mask earlier. We good? We're good. That's great, nice. guys, but don't get too friendly because you'll be facing each other again soon in an even bigger rematch. I just need time to build something. Oh. Baron, since when have you built anything ever? Well, I'm not actually building it myself, but I am designing it. In the meantime, I have some great opportunities for both of you to build off the success of tonight's show. Cole, an up-and-coming promotion in Japan wants you to go wrestle for them. Ho, ho, ho! Even Japan can't escape the energy of Black Hole Cole. <laughs> right. Actually, they explicitly said to not do that character. They just want Cole Quinn. And Buzz, we are headed south of the border for a match versus Mexico's hottest luchador, El Mago! Es increíble! 
What? I took a few years of Spanish in high school. What? Guess that'll be useful on our trip. Hey, big things are happening for us in BCW. It's all coming together. Yes. Now, what do you say we bring it in for a big celebratory BCW handshake? Yeah. Uh... That's a terrible handshake, honestly. Honest to God, that is a terrible handshake. So I wonder who Cole Quinn's facing in Japan. I wonder if he'll, uh... Face, um... A certain... A certain gentleman. Under the name of Y2J. A chunk of my skin. Gross. Just get that windscribe switch. The windscribe, windscreen. Yeah, it's repair. Baron Blade, what do you got to say? This is huge. That we're already expanding internationally. Our plan to take it to Triple H and WWE is working faster than expected. Yep. I'll have to admit, I doubted you a little bit when, when you told me about all this. But so far, it's all coming together, like you said it would. See? You just needed to trust me. I know. You got any chips for, re for wrestling in Mexico? Study up on some Lucha Libre footage. Yes. As you know, it's a completely different style. And if you accidentally drink the water there, Make sure you wear brown tights. Huh. Well, I guess we'll head to Mexico next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, it's been a pleasure. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification if you want to be a part of the Crimson Crew. Follow us on Twitch as well at twitch.tv forward slash Kasai Red. And of course, we'll be continuous next time. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Goodbye!